mean, it was just, it's one of those things that, I mean, if you're really willing to work at it, yeah. I mean, there's some resources there. I mean, sometimes people just, I mean, want that entitlement process and it's like, okay, I'm majoring in positive. I expect to be taken care of for the rest of my life. And unfortunately, in 2019, that's just not the thing. I mean, <laughs> I mean you face it, folks. I mean, we're going to live for a good long time. <laughs> it's not like the days of 1985 where, yeah, okay, I'm HIV positive, I have AIDS, and you're making out your final will of testament because you know it's only going to last for another two years. Yeah, so, yeah. So, I mean, and, and I'm not laughing because I'm like, oh, God, that's funny. I'm like, no, but... I mean, but it's, I mean it's, it's that mindset. Reality. people. It's the mindset people have. That, I mean, many individuals just haven't been able to that are living with HIV, especially newer diagnoses, just haven't been able to catch up to what it's like today. I mean, mm -hmm. they see the old images of it. They see movies like Philadelphia and the Dallas Buyers Club, and they see what it was like well, in the bad well, days. Well, like, they, people still believe that stuff, <laughs> I mean, too. That, like,